Hi family, oh my word, I'm so crusty, I haven't been here for some time now and I am in my crustiest form because I realized that if I don't do it now, I probably will not, will not do it. Um, I'm currently studying, so I just thought let me pick up the camera and speak to you guys because a lot of you have been coming for me, um, it's been a month and a few weeks since I've posted because I am at my worst okay so a lot of you have been asking why i haven't been posting and the truth is i've been very sick so so um beginning of my recess which is like a school break um around um that's uh, around march i i i Okay, so I planned that March, the two weeks, so March leading into April, I was going to shoot content because I haven't been here and I haven't been shooting content. So I had it all planned out. I was going to go out. I was going to do this. I was going to do this. And... Who was I fooling? Guys, I felt sick. So, um... It started off as just like abdominal pains here and there um, and then suddenly I had nausea and then suddenly I had um, I was vomiting guys it led from one thing to another to another that I I did a lot of things because I was confused what, what's wrong with me um, at some point I thought I had acute um, gastroenteritis um, at some point, I thought maybe I had bowel obstruction because I was constipated. Um, and the weird thing is I had diarrhea. Like, so I had diarrhea for a period of time. I took pills to stop the diarrhea and I went constipated. And it was hell. So, like, I was just on and off, on and off. I was um, constantly at a doctor. Um, and so, eventually, I was told that I had dehydration. And then now I had to be put on drips. So also I was I didn't have vitamins. And then with that I, I, I was given vitamins. So I took multivitamins. I took folic acids. I took um so I just took vitamin pills. Um so it went on for a while and I wasn't so like I'd get better after I got my IV. I'd get better after I was given my IV line. Time would pass and I'll be sick and it would be worse like at night but when it was severe it would be worse during the day so there was nothing I could eat whenever I eat I vomit though I couldn't even drink water I couldn't do a lot of things and when they told me I had dehydration it felt so good because at least I knew what was wrong with me because all this time I'm wondering what's wrong with me why am I sick why this why that and when they told me that I had dehydration at least I cheated my dehydration and when I was also told that I don't have vitamins, at least I cheated that. So um um also when school opened, like when we were done with recess, I had a test. So everything was just messed up. I couldn't even study for my test, I couldn't even prepare. I had to go write the test. Um so I went and I wrote the test and I realized after that that I had fallen behind. Hence, I couldn't even shoot content after that, even when I got better, because now I had to catch up on all the work that I had to do. Because when we opened, I missed like almost a week of, of of work and of school because I still wasn't okay. I was on and off, so I'd be fine and I'd go back to being sick and I'd be fine and I'd go back to being sick. So I, I've been trying to recover. So my April has been... um like that so beginning of my april for two weeks in my april i was sick and then the rest of the april i've been trying to recover uh, my work so also i look so much better now i can shoot content except the crustiness i look so much better guys i was terrible i even lost weight like drastically like to a point that my jeans looked like sweatpants that's how bad it was but now Everything is better. I even got to do my hair, even though it looks crappy now. But guys, I feel so much better, and I'm hoping that I can come back with content, um, and I can shoot content. Also, it's really difficult to shoot content where I am because I don't know anyone. All right, I don't know anyone. There's no nice places to go, so I can't vlog. So the only vlogs you'll ever get is me being here. Um. But I'm hoping to at least shoot a vlog the next time I go out. 
wish me luck because the next time i go up go out will be to celebrate the fact that i'm well now um so i might just dedicate it to that and not shoot a vlog but if i i i can i will shoot a vlog for you guys and we'll just you know take it from there we'll take it one step at a time it's not easy being a youtuber um as as i thought because for me when i started the channel was just i want people to have a platform where they can communicate with um each with me and other people so we can just get to know each other get to go through struggles together that was it that was the reason i started my channel but with time i realized that it's not just that it's editing it's shooting it's dedicating time it's actually knowing what to shoot and actually having people who are willing to come to the channel people some people don't really want to talk about their problems because they're still in the journey and some people just don't want to talk about like i mentioned that i'll get people to come to the channel to come speak about their degrees people don't want to talk about it because you know we come from fam black families unfortunately not to be racist but um we, we have a lot of fears as individuals so a lot of people would rather not and me being in another province from pretoria um a lot of my friends are left that side but now that i'm better i think i'll travel more and i'll go to them and i'll anyone who wants to shoot content please hit me up guys i'm available um with appointments and with discussion as long as you can communicate with me i definitely can make time and then we can shoot okay and then tell me what you guys would like to see on my channel i haven't been able to shoot cooking videos as well because literally i've been living off um cereal i hate cereal guys but lately i've been living off cereal and pies and a lot of takeaway i haven't been cooking because honestly there's no time guys there's no time i have a lot of assignments to catch up on i have due dates that i'm chasing but guys i promise to try a bit more now than i used to but I think more than anything, I'm just grateful for life and I hope that everyone is fine. Please comment in the comment section and tell me how you're feeling. Please just engage with me. Let's communicate. And uh, I hope the next video I'll look cuter than this, okay? I didn't even do anything to myself. I didn't even comb my hair. I didn't. I just showered now and I was like, let me just shoot. And this is what I can give you guys. I'm just going to post this just because i know if i don't do it now i probably won't do it because it's there's a lot of things guys that come with what i'm studying so it i thought okay first year is hard i thought okay second year <laughs> it's really hard i think the higher you go the harder it gets especially now that i'm in another province um I still am trying to get used to the environment. Trust me, it's been months, but I'm still not used to the environment because um, I literally go from here to the hospital and that's it. So it's really, 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 really um, contentless environment. I mean, <laughs> what do we shoot? But um, yeah, guys, I really don't have a lot to say. All I can say is please don't give up on me. Please don't give up on me. To all my 616 subscribers, I see you guys. And I'm so grateful that you guys still stood. And that some of you still subscribed while I'm not here. Even though it's like five, six people. I'm truly grateful and I see you guys. And um, I'm actually working on something now. But I can't tell you guys as yet. But I definitely will tell you as soon as it's in place. Um, and I'd like to give a shout out to a girl, Barke Kanyesile. She's been doing an amazing job taking care of my channel behind the scenes while I'm not here. Okay. So Kanyesile, thank you. Um, if you see this video, shout outs. And to everyone else who's been nagging me on WhatsApp, pinging me on Instagram, I see you guys. I see you guys. And on Instagram, I probably won't reply, but on WhatsApp, I try and say, okay, guys, I'll try my level best. And for now, this is what I can offer. This is what is my level best. And I hope you guys will forgive me for the crustiness, for the background, for everything. Also, I still don't have my ring light. I still don't have my ring light. Can someone just give me some sense of urgency so that I can go fetch my ring light from home so that I can shoot content? Because either way, this is the lighting. If I don't get my ring light, this is the lighting that I can offer you guys. This is the lighting. Okay, I'm, I'm so I'm dependent on natural lighting. And if it's not corresponding, it's not corresponding. But this is the only 
lighting that I can give to you guys. And I'm glad that most of you are just accepting. This is me. And this is how I run my channel. And this is how my channel is moving. But, um... So, yeah, that's all I really wanted to say. Please keep subscribing. Please keep liking my videos. Please co keep commenting. The comments have went down, and that's worrying, and that's sad. It's really making me sad because I used to get people who really comment on my channel, but now people don't. And I don't know. Maybe it's because criticize me. Maybe it's because um, my videos are not as nice as they used to be or something. But let's communicate. Let's engage. And also, I haven't fully recovered, okay? So I haven't fully recovered also mentally and emotionally as well because it really did take a toll on me because i really didn't expect to be sick so um please do uh um pray for me just pray for me and yeah more than um except this i've been running on the word of god and i've, I've been uh, standing on his promises that he said that he will never leave nor will he ever forsake me also the fact that he mentioned that there is, by his stripes i am healed that's what i've been um dwelling on and i've been taking it easy because i can't dish out content to you guys if i'm not okay if i'm not well be it emotionally be it physically be it mentally i can't give you guys content because then it's just going to be fake i'm you see i'm as clear as i can be i'm as natural as i can be because i haven't had time to do anything so um more than anything guys thank you so much for the support and thank you for, so much to those who knew that i wasn't well and still wished me well um to those who checked up on me thank you very much guys i really appreciate it and to my parents oh my word guys my parents are the best literally they took me through my my sickness from the beginning till the end they never judged me they never were like you need to focus on school you can't be saying you know they literally understood that i really was sick because it would be if if it were other parents they probably would have rushed me to return back to school you know it's just dehydration it's nothing major they understood they literally understood and they were there for me when i needed um hospitalization the way they my partner as well thank you so much literally they've been great help they've been amazing help but more than anything thank you guys too thank you so much to you guys who are my subscribers who are here with me who are um, uh, in this household but i'm back booming and bad and i hope you guys will stay tuned and i hope you guys will tell me what you want to see and i hope we can actually give out the content that people want to see okay because that's why we are here okay <laughs> and if anyone has been going through the most trust me how we won you are not alone okay we are all going through something and if somebody can say oh, hey, April has been an amazing month or rather 2021 has been amazing an amazing month go buy the tips just give me tips because my 2021 has been going has been going that's all I can say that's why YouTube has my YouTube um, posting has really dropped so if there's anyone who says oh, they, they, they've literally had a had like been having an amazing 2021 please teach us or tell me what to do because Feels like I've been in this year for year, years now. Trust. But anyways, thank you so much, guys. Let me get back to studying because that's what I've been doing. Um, without further, I, I don't know why I wanted to say that, but <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> Bye.